Yo, welcome back. So today what I figured we'd do is we'd uh, have a little bit of a recap of uh, what we've been opening over the past few months on the channel. Uh, this binder has appeared in like all of the videos so far. It's just obviously not been the uh, the star of the show because uh, uh, generally that's that'll be the packs. And, uh, I, I don't I don't know why my camera is doing this, but uh, it's slowly moving upwards for some reason, uh, and I don't know why. But uh, anyways. Uh, I, I figured I'd show off uh, what we pulled so far in, in everything and I can just talk through like what we've what we've opened and all that good stuff so uh, again I I'm trying my best with the the like um, the the lighting here I know it's it's like shining on these cards so I, I'm gonna be doing like a bit of uh, manualing manual camera working I, I suppose just to show off the cards and so because I I, I don't want stuff like this to be happening where you can't actually see the cards so uh but anyways we'll start up here and we've got the charmander and tapu coco v max and now this these two cards were from the first opening that i did on the channel which was ba basically a test opening um there was a lot from that video that i learned and i asked a, a couple of my friends to to give me some feedback on what i should do better but um but yeah, th these are the two cards that I got from that opening. Uh, I only opened three packs uh, because as I said, it, it was purely for testing, really. Uh, but we did manage to get the Tapu Coco VMAX uh, from our Billion Stars Blister Packs. Uh, but yeah, that, that, that started off the channel. And then moving on, we've got a Lucario V-Star from a uh, Crown Zenith uh, booster box. That's the promo that you get. So the next few cards are from Crown Zenith. So we've got the Altaria. And then we've got two Riolus down here. And then I believe this Boss of Daughters is actually from Brilliant Stars. So we must be moving to Brilliant Stars already. Now there is only two cards from this. And this again was another booster box. Uh, not booster box. Uh, elite trainer box. Um, we've only got the Boss of Daughters Hollow. And then the, the Whimsicott V-Star. There was actually a Mimic UV and a Mimikyu VMAX in that, but uh, I took them out of this binder to put in my Brilliant Stars Master Set because they were cards that I didn't have yet. So that's why they're not there. And then if we move down here, we've got uh, Obsidian Flame. So this is the Elite Trainer Box promo, the Charmander uh, illustration rare. And then we've got the Clefable EX. And then we've got the like cool looking Umbreon that I pointed out pretty early on in, the, in that video and then we've got a dark right hollow as well so I'll just put the camera down for a second we can then move on to the next page and i'll just bring try and bring it back a little bit yeah there we go so th this page is a little bit more impressive than that first one but uh, i'll just zoom in so we've got the river room ex and the pidgeotto and i believe that these and the uh, the clefable from the first page these were all from a uh, an elite trainer box uh, and then at some point i think it must it must be this victini that that we moved on to the to the booster box uh so yeah we've got two victinis unfortunately so we've got duplicates uh we've then got a tyranitar ex coriadin ex absol ex and then we've got if i can try and get the, the right out yeah there we go we've got a scissor illustration rare and then down here we've got a Lechonk illustration rare. Then the Ortega Full Art. Charizard EX Terra Full Art. And then our IceQ EX uh, Special Illustration Rare. And then to round it out, we've got our gold basic fire energy here as well. So what I, I, I just tell you what I'm going to be doing with these. I am going to be taking all of these out because I am collecting them. Um, a master set for Obsidian Flames. So all of these Obsidian Flames cards, besides probably a Victini up here, we may as well just keep one of them in there. Um, I'm going to be taking all of these out just to put in that set. Um, and that, uh, that means I can just finish out that set and it, it looks a bit cleaner as well. And it also means the next time I do one of these videos, we're not going over all of the same cards again. Um, so it, it, it should look a little bit different next time. But anyways, we'll just carry on. Uh, I believe these were from the the lunchbox tins that we opened that potentially had the uh, Silver Tempest God Packs in. They, ours didn't, 
but uh, I still opened four of them anyway, and I believe that uh, we got these as uh, uh, as like uh, they're, they're not promo cards because they're actual hollows from, or well, they're not hollows, but the cards from um, Paldea Evolved. They they just got a hollow pattern on them uh, for being in in that uh, lunchbox, so that's where they came from. Uh, and then obviously we've got Silver Tempest. Uh, we've got the Copperaja from Paldea Evolved. And then we've got the Chi Yu from Paldea Evolved. Uh, we've got the More Wild from Silver Tempest. Uh, Boss's Orders, that is also Paldea Evolved. Uh, we've got Arcanine EX from Scarlet Violet Base. And then we've got the Gold Superior Energy Retrieval, and that's from Paldea Evolved again. Uh, and then we've got the Skun Tank alternate art from Silver Tempest. So. While we didn't get the God Packs, we did pretty well with the packs in that video. Um, but yeah, we can just move on. So, I think that, yeah, that was it for the uh, for the uh, the lunchbox tins. And then we move on to the Darkrai Premium Collection box that I opened. So obviously the Darkrai and the Darkrai V-Star are the promos. Or, I say promos, but they're, they are, again, cards from Astral Radiance, I think it is. Um, but yeah, we got them from that box. We then got the Irida Hollow Rare. Uh, we got the Cleaver V from Astral Radiance. We got a Houndoom from Brilliant Stars, and then we got the Fantina Rainbow Rare from Lost Origin, as well as the Dracon V Star and the Delphox V from Lost Origin. And I'm not sure if these were from the same product or not. I think they must have been. This is a lot of hits though for like eight packs. Maybe we just did very well, or maybe I'm just forgetting a product. But uh, anyways, we've got a Spirit Tomb. Uh, it's not an illustration, a Trainer Gallery card. Yeah, I'm already forgetting the names. Uh, we've got a Radiant Steelix, Reverse Hollow Dragonite. I, I just thought they looked cool. Uh, and then uh, Deoxys Hollow Rare from Fusion Strike. And then moving on to the next page, uh, this is the Charizard Ultra Premium Collection. So. Here you can see the uh, Charizard V, alternate art V that was taken out to, to be used as a promo. Very cool looking card. We've then got the Charizard V Max, which looks like it's on a destructive rampage. Uh, and then we've got the Charizard V Star, which was in the Japanese version of Crown Zenith, but was taken out to be put in the Charizard Ultra Premium Collection. Uh, and I actually have the the Mew, Mew 2 version of this card, so I can see it from the other angle as well. Uh, and then from this, we got the Inteleon V from Fusion Strike, the Zamazenta V from Astral Radiance Trainer Gallery. So that's a cool card. We then have the Drampa V from Brilliant Stars. And then I think, yeah, we must have had some Evolving Skies. We got the Umbreon V Max but not the one we're after, uh, unfortunately. Uh, so yeah, that was from Evolving Skies. And I believe that was just it for the Charizard Ultra Premium Collection. We didn't really get many hits considering there was like, what, 16 packs in that? Uh, we only got, what, four hits? So kind of weak return, but uh, I, I think those sets are notoriously hard to, to get pulls on. But uh, anyways, we can move on. We've now got the Snorlax Illustration Rare. This is a promo card from the uh, Scarlet and Violet 151 Elite Trainer Box. Uh, so we're moving on to 151 already. Um, it feels like um, that wasn't too long ago, but obviously, uh, yeah, so longer than I thought ago, which is uh, bizarre to think of. But anyways, uh, to start off, we've got uh, Nine Tails EX. We then got the Charizard Full Art, which was a pretty spicy pull. We then got the Gold Psychic Energy. And then a Charizard EX, just a regular ultra rare. So let's turn over and see what else we've got. So yeah, we've got uh, a couple of the, the hollow energies and you, you can still see the ridiculous hollow patterns even through the plastic uh, and with the weird lighting that I've got here. Uh, I believe these are from the, uh, the, the starter collection boxes. Uh, I think I opened two of these. Um, so yeah, these are the, the the promos from that. So we've got the Bulbasaur, the Charmander, 
and then down here we've got the Squirtle uh, and then we've got a Golem EX uh, a Ninetales EX and a Charizard EX again obviously we got those both uh, in the previous uh, elite, elite Trainer Box as well uh, we've then got a Bills Transfer Full Art and then an Omastar and I don't know if you can see this properly but the, along the top of this is actually a crimped card um, so because I'd never actually got one of those before I did take it out and put it in this in this little collection here uh, uh, and then we've got some more hollow energies we've got water we've got electric and then up here we've got fighting and steel and that that is it for the initial uh, like wave uh, of scarlet and violet 151 I think we're moving on to something else in just a second but uh, again like with the obsidian flames I'm going to be taking a lot of these cards out to be putting into my uh, Scarlet and Violet 151 uh, set um, so again a lot of these are going to be coming out of this binder um, so next time I do this like with Obsidian Flames you're not going to be seeing a lot of these cards uh, obviously with any of the duplicates I'll probably be taking them out uh, not taking them out I'll probably just put them uh, to the start of where th the rest of these cards were but uh, yeah a lot of these cards you won't be seeing again in this collection uh, but if I ever do like a, a showcase of Obsidian Flames or 151 once those sets are finished, then you'll probably see them there. But uh, anyways, moving on, we now have a Shaman V Star. So I believe this came with a Shaman V as well for Brilliant Star. The, the, these are cards from uh, Brilliant Stars itself, uh, but they were classed as, as like promo cards. Uh, I took the V out to be put into my Brilliant Stars Master Set. Uh, so that's why that that one isn't there. But uh, in in that box, we got the Radiant Heatran, the Weird Ear from what is it, Astral Radiance. Uh, we've got an Aerodactyl V from Lost Origin, and we may have got some other stuff, but I may have taken them out uh, to be put in, in in sets elsewhere. And then we are back to another Snorlax illustration rare, which means. Uh, we, we are back to 151 Elite Trainer Boxes. So from that, we've got a Jinx. We've got a Golem. we then got the Charmander Illustration Rare. And then we've got the Zapdos EX Special Illustration Rare. So that was a really good opening, that. Uh, very cool little card, this. And again, this will, this will be moved out into the proper set like the others. And then we've got another Steel Energy here. And then I wonder if... We, no, that was it. So... We are then moving on to Crown Zenith again. So these were the Reggie Alecki and Reggie Drago uh, collection boxes. I think they came with like four packs each. Uh, and then from that, uh, we got these Reggie Alecki and Reggie Drago. Pro I say the promos, but again, they're, they're actual cards from Evolving Skies. They've just got uh, a different hollow pattern on them, or they were given a hollow pattern. I'm not sure if these were hollows and Evolving Skies. But from from those boxes we got a B, uh, like a signed pro, uh, not promo, but signed like holo card. Pretty cool. Uh, we then got a Manaphy, uh trainer gallery card, a Swablu, a ho -O -V, uh, and we've got... Oh no, we... So we, we didn't get much from the, uh, from the Crown Zenith boxes there, did we? Interesting. I'm not sure what this is. What did did we open a Silver Tempest Elite Trainer box? We might have done. I can't remember. I, I should have written this down. But anyways, uh, this is from Silver Tempest, and again the the Milotic down here is Silver Tempest, uh, and then the Dragapult is also Silver Tempest. Uh, and then I think these are from the three pack blisters of Crown Zenith. So these are the promos. We've got Rillaboom, Cinderace, and then up here we've got Inteleon. And then from them we got the Magnazone uh, Trainer Gallery card. We've got an Altaria again. I think that was one of the first uh, cards we pulled from the original like, ETB that we opened. Uh, then we've got the Simiseer V-Star, the Hop Signed Hollow, uh, and then I think in that video I opened up um, an evolutions pack because I got one with one of my uh, P 
PSA cards, I think it was. Um, so that was just a bit of a, a fun one. It probably wasted uh, a lot of money by opening that. I could have sold that uh, for much more than the, these cards are worth, but I, I figured it'd be a bit of fun just to open them up. But uh, yeah, I, I, again, with a lot of these Crown Zenith cards, if I've not actually already got them in the set, they will be taken out uh, to be put into my Crown Zenith Master set. So yeah, yeah, I, I'm envisaging quite a lot of the cards from this binder being taken out to be put in separate sets. Uh, but uh, yeah, I, I've not really looked into that just yet. But uh, yeah, I'm just letting you know that that's going to be happening. Um, and then... We've got an Electabuzz. Uh, I believe these came from the, what was it? The Zapdos and Alakazam boxes. Uh, so for whatever reason, one came with a, an Electabuzz and then the, the Alakazam box actually came with a with an Abra, Kadabra and an Alakazam. And then obviously we've got the Zapdos EX there as well. And then this next page should be the hits that we got from them. So from that we got a hollow grass energy, we've got a Venusaur EX, we've got the War Turtle illustration rare, and then we've got Erica's Invitation special illustration rare. That's a really cool little card there. Try and get you a better view of it. But yeah, very cool, very detailed card, just very nice. Uh, and yeah, like like with the rest of the um, Scarlet and Violet 151, that, that'll be taken out as well. And then what was this? Ah, this this is the Charizard uh, EX Premium Collection. So we recently opened a, a Gyarados one, uh, and this is the Charizard one. So we got a Hollow Charmander and Charmeleon, and then we actually got a promo card because from the the, the Gyarados one we opened recently, it was actually just a copy of uh, of the Terra EX from uh, Scarlet and Violet Base. This one is actually a promo in its own right. You can see by this uh, black star symbol here. It means it's an actual promo. Uh, and obviously from that, we only got the Rolts uh, illustration. I feel like we probably got more than that, but uh, I must have taken stuff out uh, to be put in other sets, but I can't actually remember if that's all we got. It does seem kind of low, because, uh, yeah. Anyways, I'm pretty sure I did open like a uh, an Obsidian Flames booster bundle as well. So there must have been some more stuff than just that one hit. But uh, I, I can't remember just off the top of my head. But uh, anyways, we'll move on. So we've got the Mew special illustration around the Mew 2 next to that. Uh, there were the promos from the Scarlet and Violet 151 Ultra Premium Collection that we opened. And again... We got a Nine Tails EX, which is like the third copy of that I think we've we've seen so far, and then a Golem EX, which I'm pretty sure we've seen b before as well. Uh, and then up here we've got the Wigglytuff EX, we've got the Nine Tails EX full art, and then we've got the Alakazam EX special illustration rare. Right? And kind of like with the uh, Erica's Invitation, this one is a very detailed looking card, a really cool card. Uh, I am pretty pleased that we got three of those. I think we we probably pulled more of those than we were supposed to, uh, but less of the actual illustration rares, uh, which actually have now increased quite significantly in price since the set has come out. Uh, so I'm hoping they go down again so I can actually buy the, the ones that I don't have. But uh, yeah, that, that's a cool card there. And then we're back to our, our hollow energies again. So that we've got darkness energy, uh, and then we've got two water energies there as well. And then moving on to this. So this is the uh, Palde, not Palde evolved. It's Paradox Rift. Near it was, it was P. So uh, yeah, uh, this was the. It wasn't Iron Valiant because I had a problem with the Iron Valiant one. Uh, it was the Roaring Moon. Elite Trainer Box, the Pokemon Center exclusive. So you can see this one is just a normal promo. And you can see here, we've got a Pokemon Center stamp on it. Uh, so you can tell that that is from the Pokemon Center exclusive Elite Trainer Box. 
Uh, and from that, we got a Bombardier EX, uh, a Hooper EX, a Garchomp EX, uh, and then a Ferrothorn Illustration Rare. And I think we may have got a few more hits from that as well. Oh no, we just got a, a page of like cool cards that I picked out from it. So we've got a Milotic Hollow and a Reverse Hollow. We've got a Groudon Hollow, Groudon Reverse Hollow there. We've got uh, Iron Jugulus Hollow Rare and then a Reverse Hollow. And then again with the Iron Moth, we've got Hollow Rare and then Reverse Hollow. Uh, we've then got a Latios, Deoxys, Steelix, and then a Brute Bonnet. So I, I just thought they were cool cards. And I initially wasn't going to pursue collecting this set, but I, I think I have changed my mind. And I will be pursuing that at some point. Um, but probably not just yet. So these will probably remain in here for now uh, until I actually get a binder together. Uh, for for Paradox Rift, but uh, yeah, uh, and then I believe this page was the hits that we got from the uh, booster box that we opened. So we've got a Galissapod EX, a Tapu Koko EX, uh, a Goldengo EX, uh, the Mewtwo EX Terra card, and then a Serena Terra EX. Uh, and then as full arts, we've got the Altaria EX, uh, the Toxtricity Terra EX, and then we've got a Tulip Supporter full art. And then we've got a uh, Mantike Illustration Rare, Iron Jugulus Illustration Rare, and then a Minum. Oh no, that's a Plusal. I, I'm not reading properly. Uh, I am reading through my phone rather than actually looking uh, at the binder itself, which is probably a problem, but anyways. Uh, plus little illustration rare, and then we got the Sandy Shocks EX special illustration rare from that. And I believe that was it for the booster box. Uh, and then we're moving on to the Iron Valiant uh, Elite Trainer box. Now, I in that video, uh, I was missing a pack and a promo card. I have since found those, uh, those uh, well, the missing pack and the promo card. Uh, I've not put the promo card in here for... I, I don't know why I didn't put it in here. But, uh, yeah. I, I just wanted to let you know that I have actually found it. And I found the pack. I did open the pack. I, I didn't want to open just one random pack uh, on a video. So I just opened it. And there was nothing in it anyway. It was just a hollow rare. So, uh, yeah. Just a, a bit of an update on that if you watched that video. But uh, from that, we got uh, Serena EX. We got Sandy Shocks EX. We then got the Vanillish Illustration Rare, and then this one is the Minin. So we've got the Plusle and Minin Duo. And then this one was the Pikachu and Zekrom GX uh, Premium Collection that we opened not too long ago, uh, a few videos ago. Uh, so obviously we've got the, the Gold GX card, the Sun and Moon promo, which is like, I, I, I believe it's the only Sun and Moon product that I've opened. Which is uh, which is a cool little tidbit. We then got the Umbreon V Max again. That's the second Umbreon V Max from Evolving Skies that we've got. But uh, obviously both are not the Moonbreon that we would be after. We then got the Galarian Slokin V Max from Crown Zenith, and then a Galarian Articuno V from Crown Zenith as well. So uh, it was a it was a cool little opening. That I was I was quite happy to get a hold of that box. But uh, yeah. We are then moving on, uh, and this is the Gyarados uh, EX Premium Collection thing that I mentioned earlier. So obviously with the Charizard, it, it was a promo card, but this one, as you can see here, is just from a set. There is no Black Star promo uh, symbol, so that is just a, a card from Scarlet and Violet Base. But uh, we got a Reverse Hollow Magikarp and a Gyarados T uh, Terra EX. Uh, from that we got Poppy uh, from Obsidian Flare. I, we did. I, I should. I should say that we also opened uh, uh, an Obsidian Flames booster bundle, so that's why there's quite a lot of Obsidian Flames stuff in here. But we got the the, the Poppy uh, full art. We then got the Larvitar illustration rare, the Cleffer illustration rare, which I think really looks really cool. It's just a really nice looking card. And then we got the, the Dene EX Terra card from Paldea Evolved. And then finally, the Eternatus VMAX from Lost Origin. 
the trainer gallery for most origin and i believe that is it so yeah plenty of plenty of uh, pages to go as you can see just get these open we've got a lot of pages to fill out with this uh, and obviously uh, i'm going to be um, taking a lot of the cards out uh, out of this uh, collection as well so i'll just open it on this page just so you've got something to look at whilst i uh, sign the video out but uh, yeah that is all of the hits that we've pulled on the channel so far or most of them at least uh, i have taken a few of these cards out uh, of the binder already but uh, yeah that's going to be it for today hopefully you enjoyed the the little recap of uh, what we've what we've been opening over the past few months uh, i'm probably going to try and do one of these every three or four months or so uh, we'll see how quickly it fills up um but uh, but yeah uh, hopefully you enjoyed uh, if you did I'd appreciate you leaving a like on the video uh, and, and if you did like I'd, I'd appreciate you maybe uh, commenting down below and uh, with what your favorite uh, card from this binder is I'm not sure myself I, I kind of like the uh, the Zapdos uh, illustration where I think Let's see if I can find it I think it might be on the previous page yeah here it is so yeah i think this one might be my favorite of what we've pulled so far uh but obviously we've got a lot of cards uh, to be pulling still uh i've I, I did a lot of buying over black friday as well uh so i've got a bunch of stuff ready to be opened for for the next couple of months which is good but uh but yeah um uh i, I do openings every friday um so if you're interested in seeing more stuff like this then uh, i would ask you to subscribe and that way you don't miss uh, any uh, any videos that i put up but uh, yeah that's gonna be it for today thank you very much for watching and i will see you in the next one